Hi, welcome to Excessive Gamer. I'm Excessive Brutality and welcome to my second Let's Play for um, Until Dawn. So my part two for Until Dawn. And we'll continue exactly where we left off. Um, let's get on with it. Let's continue. Jessica, upper cable car station, 941. Mother you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. The hell am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Oh, sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> ah, bitch. Can't hate me, motherfucker. Gotta try harder than that, hero. Too good, too swift with my little fucking little kid, man. Where are you hiding, little chicken? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, right in your hi. face, you bitch! Hey! Oh snap! Uh, the birdie. Look at the birdie. Fuck it, don't forget about the birdie, motherfucker. Hit the Hello. fucking bird. Come on. <laughs> hey, Mike! Boom, shaka okay. laka. <laughs> no, you got me. Okay. It's a fun little sequence. <laughs> I don't fucking want to do the right thing. I know all your tricks. Hit the fucking bird, bitch. <laughs> yeah. Actually, in real life, I'm not that evil to animals. Damn, Jess. Look what you did. I know, I know. Oh. Sweetie birdie. Stone cold, Jess. I didn't do it on purpose. Oh, yes, you did. Oh, my God. Michael? Oh, <laughs> gotcha. It's done. Done city. So, did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> Again with the weird teeth. So if I did. All right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor, then? You're a worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. <laughs> ah! Fuck you. Oh, ho, ho. It's weird painting. Okay. Woman. Okay, you're lady. really gonna get it. What am I gonna get? See, if no. I would have played the guy, I would have gone to kiss. Think of it but one. since I'm playing the woman. Yeah. But you'll have to wait until later. Playing differently, you know? Did you hear that? Oh, shit. Uh, yeah, sounds like... Whoa! Oh, my God! Ah, man. That was... Should have left it. Really close. Seen the Something was going to kill us. Yeah, I mean... Wow. It's instinctive, you know? Toast. Well, See the triangle, you need to press it. you got the timer, count down, and it's getting you all... Nervous, you gotta press the button. You gotta press the button. I press the button. Button. Did. Hello again. Hello, doctor. And how are we feeling? I'm fine. How you doing? In our last session, we established that you have a fear of things that are dead or undead. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Obviously. For anyone who knows me, obviously. Oh shit, 
This is all. This is basically written for me. I fucking really hate heights, and I don't mind either one. Either one of those, I'm not bothered. But if I'm gonna see anyone, I think maybe a snake is better. I don't know. Guns or knives? I think knives are scarier than guns. Yep, definitely knives. Roaches or rats? Roaches or rats? Roaches or rats? Roaches are more disgusting. So I said roaches. The thing is, insects and rodents and stuff like that just doesn't really do it for me. Oh well, this one's easy. Clowns, every fucking time. Go, crows. Actually, none of them bother me that much. But, uh, well, I'd say go, maybe, more than crows. Oh. Did I startle you? Not at all. So sorry. Not at all, mate. It's okay. You're doing very well. You, you go ahead and do it again. Don't be nervous. Whatever you need to do, doctor. I'm cool. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will don't be. Don't give me that the pressure. More lightning you will find this experience. I don't need the pressure. Fuck you. I take my time. 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 Ah. Who cares about needles? Don't mind needles. Definitely not zombies. I urge a, f a zombie apocalypse. I'm ready for it, mate. I've played so many zombie games. I'm ready for a zombie apocalypse. Definitely. Except for my fitness, I think. Maybe the running should run a bit more. Storms? No, I'll stay with go. I'll keep go. Thank you very much. This is very interesting. Thank you. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Cockroaches, clowns, and awful. <laughs> Some combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid once again we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. Thank fuck for that. Goodbye, doctor. Thank you. Fucking freaky bastard. Such a fucking freak. <laughs> I love him. So freaky. I love freak. Love it. I'm talking about freaky. Love it. Love it. Previously. Watch this part. Quiet. Stop fucking talking. Don't you guys think this is a little bit... Oh, come on. She deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. No! Shut First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb Darkness. it. Oh, yeah. Nine hours till dawn. Same to me. Josh. Really cool character. Complex, thoughtful, and loving. Josh, Hannah, and Beth's brother. Unfortunately for Josh, that means... He's got no siblings. Poor Josh. Maybe if I took a left turn instead of a right turn. So sorry, Josh. So sorry, mate. So sorry. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. Yeah, 
When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Oh, well, more or less, but it is so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, yo, yo. You get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Hey, you doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in, they're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like, get open or something. Wait a second, are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Hey, cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not gonna bang her, maybe Michael take up the case. Wait, will you back off already? Relax. Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Maybe you're right. <sighs> You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Koshis, or else you got four lovely ladies who are gonna be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh shoot, nobody likes cool buns. Hmm. Damn, I'm getting pretty low on juice here. I just had to turn off my GPS. I'm finally like outside where I might actually use it. Can you cool it on the phone talk? What? Why? It's pretty much all you talk about. Well, you know, I mean, I can do all this stuff and... Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this.
Oh, great. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's a, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. <laughs> All right, one minor observation. Why the hell is he holding a lighter if uh, he has a mobile phone? With a torch, I guess. I mean, all mobile phone have torches now, so. Just an observation, just me being a bit, you know, picky. That was interesting, that was interesting. It's carrying a lighter, can get a bit funky with premonition of a fire. Not good, not good. Go down this, go around, man. Let's go this way. Into the mansion we go. What's this? Huh? <laughs> That's cool. The Washington family. They look such a happy bunch. Till we accidentally killed the two sisters. It wasn't our fault really, but you know, huh? I was rooting for it. What the hell was that? Falling down the cliff. Good fun. Let's keep quiet. It's scary now. Yeah. Yeah. Not working. It's not working. It's not working. Oh. Hi, Chris. Very funny. <laughs> oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be like getting the lock open or something? On it. All right. Look for the aerosol spray, the ordering can, or what? Let's go around this way. Walk a bit faster, dude. Walk a bit faster, dude. There we go. With a bit of authority. Let's go up here. Up. Right now, there's a bit of glare on my screen, so I'm struggling to see because it's so dark in the game. But I'm managing. Hey, look, that's a bathtub we saw in the uh, in that office. CCTV thing. We have a creep. Fucker! Get the fuck! Ah! Fucking bitch! Hand there in the fucking little aerosol cupboard. Motherfucker! Ah, Not cool. Not cool at all. We're freezing our buns off out here. Fucking badger thingy. Opening the door. Opening the door. Uh, 
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. God! <laughs> ah, crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. We'll do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. It's not a fight. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. Yeah. What the hell were you doing with M out on the trail? What? I saw you and M. Through the telescope. I love confrontation. Before? We just ran into each other. It's been a while, so we hugged and I said hello. Is that against the law? Um, right. Right, I'm sure it's all it was. You know what? You can think whatever you want. It's a free country. Watch yourself, Mike. Such a hospitable young man. That is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Yeah. I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Hey, you're making everyone uncomfortable, Jess. Jealous much? Emily too frigid for you too. Hey, that's that's uncall. Look, whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. On a roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Jessica, you need to shut your mouth, okay? No. You're the one who needs to keep your nose out of other people's business. I'm about to get right up in your business, you bitch. Are we about to get real? Because I am down to get real. Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. Okay, if we can't get along for 10 minutes, then maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Wanna go do that? Any place without that whore. It, it's right up the trail. <sighs> Glad that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, Do I... you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm? We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Ah, <sighs> exactly.
exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, Barr. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars! Gonna need these. Porn star? I pay to see ya. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. All right, let's go up to that lodge. I love the animations of the characters. And the interaction, very good. Hey, Hot Lips, photo booth. All right, read my mind. No? Okay. Just take the face then. Oh my god. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Wink. Noted. <laughs> Let's move on. Here we go. Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. So cheesy. Cheesy 80s bloody horror. I keep saying 80s, it's just that was so cheesy. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. Ah, uh, yeah, she's a handful. But maybe ease up on her. She's still kind of torn up from being dumb. Um, hello. Not my problem, Mike, and not yours either. Uh, yeah. How's it my fault? She doesn't understand what beat it you skank means. <laughs> yeah, like a crack a dictionary much, biatch? Huh. Guess this thing needs juice or something. Didn't Josh say there was a generator? I wish you could generate a little excitement about getting that freaking generator to work. Okay, I'll, I'll just yell at it like you're yelling at me. Let's see if that works. Okay. All right. Let's see. Boom. Nice one, Mikey.
Shazam! The gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. That's just awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hit. <laughs> You psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. It's all such a blur. You barely even remember what happened. Well, what I remember is that we played a stupid half-baked prank that probably got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, I mean, it's not our fault they ran into the woods. Yeah. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that? Look at the lighting. It's, it's okay. Um, did you hear that? It's a pigeon. It's just a pigeon, man. Something. It's just a pigeon. Yeah. Carry on. Don't think about it. Just, just a pigeon. Just a little pigeon. Move on. Carry hey. on. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh no way! Am I going back to the lodge, aka wax museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily? Ah! Ah! Oh, you yes! stupid woman! Fuck. You're gonna make me go in there hey, after? Jessica! I don't think so. Yeah. I don't fucking think hey. so. Mm -mm. Um, okay. mm -mm. No, 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 you fell, you fucking pick fell. yourself right up. Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? <laughs> uh, seven limbs. I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. I would have done heroic, so I'm going to go with cautious this time. I want to see what it, what it would do. All right, Jess, there's a cart. I think if you can push it, you can get by. All right. Okay, let me just try. It's too heavy. All right, try it again. It's super heavy. Maybe you already loosened it a bit. Hey, Michael. I'm like pretty ripped at all, but I don't think I can move it. Any other bright ideas? All right, Jess, I'm gonna drop the light down. Okay? Look alive. What? Look al all right, just heads up. Get it? Yeah, yeah, I got it. <sighs> ah! Ah! Jess! Jess, what the hell? What was that? Are you okay? I, I, I saw something. What? Uh, something moved. Okay, it's probably just like a bat or something. A bat? All right, coming after you. Just stay put. My bat have rabies. Well, it's not gonna bite you. Okay, that's what bats do. They bite me. Well, hello. Shall we?
This is giving me the willies, and not the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin, Buster. Rubber. Part in the cave we could have explored, but uh, I thought maybe we could end up going back. But I suppose we just carry on going this way. Well, well. When Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? <sighs> Take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech, buddy. Oh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees. Gonna look at the clouds. Gonna look at the cab. Um. Whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. Jess? Mm-hmm. Stay close by, okay? What's that? Uh, this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, Michael, I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please. Come on. Let's not hug <laughs> a bear. your host letting you walk around these parts on your own this time of night with this weather. Watch out, bird brain. Told you it was a pigeon. Rat wings. Oh, poor Mikey. Did the little birdie get your panties all bunched up? She's a gross. Like diseases and shit. Cabin very far away. Okay, we see it in the sun. Says cabin. Damn it, Josh! You have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here. Fuck sake! Really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? 
Stand back, Debbie Downer. Oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Ah. Boo! <laughs> Little bit. Okay. Okay. Well, that's how it's gonna be. What the fuck? Yes? Where's he gone? Yes! Do that. Alright guys, that is where I leave it for now and um, hope that you join me for the third part. Um, hope you liked it. If you liked the video, please leave a like, comment also and appreciate if you uh, subscribe to my channel. Um, thank you very much for watching. See you next time.